Hello my friends, I am back and for today's video, finally I will be decorating, organizing and just, you know, decorating my living room which has been empty for the past couple of weeks I would say. So I really hope you guys enjoy this video. guys i want to mention that this portion of the video it is sponsored by 25 home and i've been so excited to open these boxes they've been sitting in my dining area for the longest ever since we moved to the new house we've been sitting on the floor because we didn't have any couches that's why we selected this couches they are from 25 home and they are called auto boutique beige plume double chase sectional they are in the color beige and we got the 140 inches as soon as we ordered them they arrived super fast and honestly the couches are amazing they're filling it's high quality with foam and feathers the sofa are so soft comfy and really bouncy they also have zippers to all the cushion that way you can take off the covers and wash them whenever you need to they're very easy to clean they also come with latches at the bottom of the couches that way you can put them together and they won't be moving around i honestly love my new couches like i mentioned they arrived super fast they were super easy to unbox and also to assemble if you guys are interested you already know you can go and click the link below on the description box to get beautiful and affordable furniture you can also get five percent off if you use my discount code gabby thank you so much to 25 home for sponsoring this portion of the video now let's continue with this vlog today we are going to be doing one of my most exciting videos and it's that i will be decorating but not just that i will be organizing decorating cleaning and shopping because finally i will be transforming my living room right now it's empty we just have that tv right there a really sad tv honestly let's go because i'm hungry first things first and i had to get the belly full you know so we went to one of my favorite spots that goes by the bone we have one of the best cucumber waters and also the wok mm -mm -mm. and of course my taquitos so this is the plan here's my living room as you guys can tell we have three walls but one of them it has a huge window therefore i only have two but this is everything i want to buy and here's some picture ideas slash inspo that way you guys can have an idea the first place we went, it was Lowe's and the reason why is because, well, I wanted to create this accent wall and also paint one of the walls where the TV is going to be at. And I didn't want nothing crazy, but I did want a little pop of color, so I went with this one. I was looking for the affordable one, you know? Is this one really bad? No, it's still a good paint. It might take you a couple coats though. Okay, then. okay. I, I could take that one. I also got everything that I needed. I found this one, but then later on, once again, <laughs> I found something cheaper. Then we went to the lumber section and we were looking for something, something that would work for what I was trying to do. And given I, we thought we were some experts. But that didn't work, so we just end up buying the first ones that we saw. I really want one of this in my living room, okay? My vision is to have it next to the big window. It will look so nice. Next. know me i had to go to goodwill to see if i could find anything honestly i didn't but i still went to the book section because you're sleeping on those books you can get them and use them as decor or you can also read them you know either way both work and then of course to the target honestly like i love it but come on come on guys come on let me see nah dude i'm trying to find which one it is what are those <laughs> Next up was raw stress for less, but honestly, I lost out the footage, so I'm sorry. Next up, one of my favorite stores, IKEA, baby. We were looking for some curtains, you know. We are deciding if we should take a rug. I'm thinking of this one. It's kind of short, but it's just perfect to have it just as decoration. And they lowered the price, so it's in clearance. It's 65 or 66 dollars but i don't know we have this and they look amazing and that's to all my haters <laughs> let's take this one. Oh, never mind honestly at this point we were so tired of looking for a floating tv stand but we couldn't so we just end up taking one of the ones they had and also a tv which was really heavy <laughs> This is how 
show the living room. It's looking. We're gonna start cleaning. Huh? Then I said, we, I met my hubby boo, start cleaning, you know, he started sweeping and then he remembered he had a Dyson which costed a thousand dollars so he put that shit to work. We bought this from Lowe's, honestly, this is the plan. We are trying to cut it in half, that way we have more than just like six of them and we bought four of this, so... so we will end up having 48. In my calculations, I will have enough just to have the accent wall that I want to have in the back. And we ended up buying 31 ounces of paint and this is the color. Hopefully this is enough. And then the Jibby the Builders this started to work and we had a little mini amino assistant, my sister aka Galilea. We started painting the walls. I did what I could, you know. Then I asked my husband to just paint the top of it because I couldn't reach. While I was struggling to cut those little pieces, they were a pain in the ass. But I really wanted that accent wall so I don't regret it. Honestly, this took forever. Long story short, we ended up going for more paint because that little can was not enough. Especially because I feel like those um, rollers, they absorb so much paint that a lot of it went to waste basically, but not really. You know what I mean, right? Now we are done with the wall and actually I love it. I love the color. The next step is to start putting those little wood things to make the accent wall. It's been a struggle though because I have to cut it in half and my my thumb already hurts i'm pretty sure that i'm gonna get a blister but at least i have some done for now and i still need to cut more PM. We took a break, we went to Gabriel's parents' house, we ate some pupusas, and we picked up this rat, aka Valeria. <laughs> and for some reason, she thinks she's part of the Power Rangers or something like that. Go, go Power Rangers! And then we continue with our project. Or not this wall took us about six hours six oh. we end up buying this at IKEA supposedly it's a set of two right mm -hmm. and they're super light you have the option to put it through the hole or through this I don't know like this strings I would say mm -hmm. oh to, through the loop whatever I believe it was around 3 p.m. and we were still working on this. Gabriel started putting the curtains while Valeria was eating like a rat. And me being mean, of course, I was trying to put everything perfect and Gabriel was over it. <laughs> We vacuum, we put up the curtains, and now it's time to put the TV. One, two, three, four. I'm so sorry. No, that's okay. Pick it, look, one of you pick it up from my bottom, and the other one pick it up from my side. Okay, the ball? Yeah. Okay, scoot it to the left. Mm -hmm. Little update you guys, 
we ended up putting the TV stand. I don't know if you guys saw that. We are going to be changing the color because we don't like it. I mean, it's nice, but it's not what we want. We added some shelves and the plant. Some photosynthesis, you know. My camera is about to die, so I need to, you know, save some battery. I've been waiting for this moment, you guys. This is the last piece for the living room. pretty much you guys i think i'm going to be making some changes but for now this is about it